Alright, we're starting our 14 day countdown to um, living here for too long and someone else's poor decision making. Um, all this caused that and I was poor. I was poor to get parts from that guy. I don't even know what this is over there. That guy lives in Florida now. If he seems still alive. Um, but, but I'm just mad because I'm going through this stuff because of just the nonsense that goes on here. It's just stupid nonsense. And I constantly start something, then I say, screw this, I'm not continuing with this, because what I make nice, someone else destroys it. And it's just ongoing, I'm looking for a transmission fluid adapter thing. Or it's just never here, that's the other thing, it's never here. That goes with steering wheel puller. So I cannot, um, I cannot basically um, fix the thing, because it's just never here. You know, it's an Azuzu situation. I, I, I talked about this in the past. It was a, um, it's like, you know, you you can't fix something when it's constantly being used. It's impossible. But now it's not being used, so perhaps you could. But I'm mad now because I'm spending extra time. That fixed my misfire, the loose coil wire. I never made that video. That was months ago. The truck was missing. had a loose coil wire. But... It just wasted my time because I'm going through stuff again that I found, and then I got mad, and then I said, um, and then I said, uh, um, screw it, I'm not doing it, and then I put it all away, and then I have to look for it again, and I put it away, and look for it again, this is a constant, um, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, I got some cool tools. Um, and yeah, this sucks. I don't know what I do with this. Uh, I don't think it's in that box over there. I'm looking for a little plug-in or uh, flush thing. Derail makes it for like a training cooler and a Chevy. I had it out and then I lost it. Oh, that's a ratchet rebuild kit. I have to organize this whole drawer. One by one, we're just organizing everything. We'll get there eventually. That's for a Chevy crank socket. We'll get there eventually. The harmonic balancer install tool. I don't want to make too much of a mess. I really want to get a small box and put all these pullers in a little tiny box in this bottom drawer so they're all organized. I'm going to have to work on that. Um, like a tiny, tiny box. I'll find one that fits in there. Um, I think I might work on that now, maybe. I don't know. Project. Hopefully, it all this crams in there nice. Like everything puller related goes in a little box. Ooh. But we're looking, and uh, we're not going to find it, but I'm just mad my 14 days to living here, and I was poor because I helped out. I helped out. I spent my own money on things. I never got um, reimbursed for like 90% of it either, so um, I went poor because of it. What did he want poor? And... I don't know what the adapter thing is. I want to change the transmission fluid on the blue truck. It's like, it literally has probably 100,000 miles or close to it on the transmission fluid, which is absurd. Which is absurd. And I wanted to change it, but the thing's always hot or it's never here. And I tried a day, I tried another day, I tried another day, I tried a day, I tried a day, I tried a day. And then that turned into, that turned into years, actually. And then it's gone for six hours. Seven hours, eight hours, then it comes back and it's gone again for another two hours. You know, how, how can you fix stuff when that's just the, uh, that's the thing? No, I put this shit back, but we're going to look for it and we're going to find it. I don't think I'd venture too far. In the meantime, we're going to organize. I wish I could open this door, but it's just so humid out. <sighs> I'll turn on this light, I guess. There's, a. Uh, Currently no food in here because some fat ass ate all the food again. I'm not mentioning any names. And now I'm having flashbacks digging through here. I see my wrecked parts of my wrecked fender from the white truck. I cut it up. It's, it's part of my original fender. I, I just threw out the rest. I should have scrapped it, but I wasn't scrapping them. So that got wrecked because someone ate all the food many, many years ago. Someone ate all the freaking food. So I went out when it was snowing. Just was a little bit. I got heavier and heavier and heavier fast. I spin out. 
boom, I crash into a Suburban. I fuck up his whole side of a Suburban. I screw up the white truck, you know, thousands and thousands of dollars. And, um, yeah, and I just fixed that side maybe like two years before. Because I got whacked in the parking lot. My first job. And everything I made at that place went through fixing the truck. Because it was a hit and run. I guess, I don't know, we didn't do insurance or some shit back there. I don't freaking know. Should have just filed a claim. Everyone was filing claims, though, because they would keep on hitting stuff. So in a period of time, I literally had freaking like ten claims. It was insane. Just people kept on crashing into shit. Every car got whacked. It was just, I don't know, just a thing, I guess. Board. Uh, anyway, we're looking for this adapter. And, um... Yeah. Another thing. Uh, helping out. Oh, you get all the food? Don't worry, I'll go get some more food. And then, um... And then, you know, I wound up crashing in the freaking snow. And then I come back with near nothing. That's all you got? I remember that. That's all you got? I go, what the? Fucking stupid. I can't deal with these people anymore. I lived here way too long. I, um, I should have been, uh, just saving for a property. Which I kind of do. I do have enough to buy land. I do have way enough. Even cover the taxes or whatever. It'd be plenty. Where I'm going, where I'll go to, it's not going to be pretty, but um, I don't know where this adapter is. It's not here. I mean, that's her 14 days um, condo land living soon, and I just made a mess, and I have to clean this up. And I can't even find what I'm doing. I can't find what I'm doing because I found it. It's right here, the thing. I found it, and then I lost it again. To the stupidity, it was right here all this time. I got some good tools though. Alright, let's go try to put this away. Transmission thing, that thing, the flush kit. I gotta find a hose that fits that. Um, I'm gonna have to disassemble the major parts of the blue truck, which is fine. We'll get rid of all the ATF over there, get rid of the filter. And then I gotta find the stuff to change the front crank seal because it's pissing oil like crazy and it's low on oil again. And I gotta lift this crap over here, push rods and other stuff. But yeah, just unbelievable how uncooperative people can just cause so much headache in your life. And this is family. Family. You know, damage on this. Damage on the white truck. Damage, damage, damage. Crashing into shit. You know, everything I fixed, someone else managed to do far more damage and it's still damaged. And who's gonna fix it? Who's gonna fix it? Are you gonna fix it? Am I gonna fix it? That thing is clear. Yeah, it's cooked here. Are you gonna fix it? I'm not gonna fix it. I gotta bag that thing. Put it in a bag like this. Are you gonna fix it? I'm not gonna fix it. So, I'm turning this off and let me go organize my bottom drawer or toolbox. You should maybe bottom drawer that. I bought this hammer too. You know why I bought this hammer? Because people keep crashing into shit and I needed to go knock a huge $4,000 dent on the side of the white truck. One day, one day, I had a China one. I bought a KD just because it was NOS. They don't make KD tools anymore. They said Master Lock went out of business. Trump's ranting about something. I have no idea. I, have, I don't follow the news anymore. Yeah. Um, maybe they did. I don't know. Maybe they didn't. I don't know. Um, but anyway, let me go clean this crap up. I need to find a small box, put all my pullers in there. It'd be mint. <laughs>